okay, we're asked to find the simplest form of a rational exponent, and this is the second method. The first method is actually to use this radical here and to turn it into an exponential value of one fourth. But there's another way to do this, and I just want to show it to you really quickly. So all I'm going to do is this. I'm going to use a couple of rules of exponents. Here's the first one. The second rule I'm going to use is that if I take a times b under a radical, as long as the radical matches, I can get square root a times square root b. So that's what I'm going to do here. I'm going to take the fourth root of 12x squared, fourth root, times the fourth root of y to the sixth power. Then I'm going to take the fourth root of z to the twelfth power. Now what I'm going to do, first off with this piece, there's not much I can do here, so I'm just going to leave this piece this way. But with this piece right here, I'm going to use this rule right here, and I'm going to say, I'm going to take the fourth root of y to the fourth times the fourth root of y squared. And hopefully you can see that this is true because y to the fourth, sorry, times y squared is y to the sixth, isn't it? Because it's y to the four plus two, right? The reason I'm going to do this is because I know that the fourth root of y to the fourth is just y, isn't it? So I'm going to take this. The answer here is y, so I'm going to take this y right here. I'm going to put it out in front, y, times the fourth root. I'm just rewriting what I already have. But also, there was nothing we could do with this fourth root of y squared, so the y squared just stays under the radical, doesn't it? So I did this part. Now what we want to do is look at this. We're looking at this piece right here. And I'm trying to figure out how many fourths can I get out. So I'm going to take the fourth root of z to the fourth times the fourth root of z to the fourth times the fourth root of z to the fourth. I'm going to test this out. z to the fourth times z to the fourth times z to the fourth is z to the twelfth, isn't it? But the fourth root of z to the fourth is z. Fourth root of z to the fourth here is z. Fourth root of z to the four here is z. And z times z times z is z cubed. So you can just do it this way. Take this y. Take our z cubed here. z cubed times the fourth root of 12x squared y squared. If this seems a little bit complicated, it's because it is. This is actually pretty tough. So hang in there. What I would say to you is do a lot of problems. If there's something I need help, let me know. Please subscribe.